Hey friends, this is Atif Opier Val and welcome to the new update on Algorand. In today's video, we will once again take a look at this huge falling wedge pattern and the price line has dropped at the key support of 16 cents as well. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member because here I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find the link to join me here in the video description I've shared. Let's start the analysis. And by the way, if you would like to see how my trading signals work, then I've also shared the link for the previous month's trading signal report uh, for the month of April 2023. And you just need to open that report. And for example, if you would like to check or verify any trading signal, like this is a trade signal for uh, SXP coin, you just need to click on the link. It will take you to the trading views chart. And there is a play button available on every trading views chart. And you just need to click that play button like I'm doing this year. And after clicking this play button, it will show you how the price and moved up from the buying zone and rallied to the sell target zone. And this was a quite big pump, by the way, on this uh, two hour time frame chart. Now, let me take you here on this weekly time frame chart. And here uh, I would like to show you once again this huge falling wedge pattern. You can see we entered the wedge here in the month of May 2021 and found a resistance in the month of September 2021. And so far, uh, the price line is not able to break out the resistance of this falling wedge pattern. There is another uh, resistance that is almost moving at the resistance of the falling wedge pattern. That is this red line. That is the EMA 21 on the weekly time frame chart. And previously, we can see when we broke it out here, uh, we had a nice rally. For a while, we broke it down here in the month of November 2020. But again, we broke it out and we had a very nice pump. And same as like that, I'm expecting that once the price line will be able to break out this resistance of the EMA 21 on the weekly time frame chart, and it can again work as a long term support for the price line. Right now, you can see that uh, the price line is still getting rejected by this resistance of EMA 21. We got rejected here uh, back in the month of December 2021. And we again had a very, very strong rejection by this EMA 21 from this uh, from, uh, in the month of October 2022. Then we had another rejection here in the month of. Step 2023 and recent rejection uh, is here. Uh, the price had moved very close to EMA 21 and got rejected. In fact, it was rejected by the resistance of the channel and EMA 21 together. And now it is dropped at the support, a very strong and long term and key support of 16 cents. Previously, this level has been working as a support here back in September 2019. And after the breakout for two weeks, it worked as a resistance. And here you can see when we had this big drop, the price line tested this support of 16 cents. We had a nice pump. And now the price line has again dropped down at the support of 16 cents. Now, at the same time, we can see that while the price line is at the support of 16 cents, the stochastic went completely oversold. And you can see how much oversold the MACD is also. And I'm expecting that once MACD will give us the bully signal, like uh, we received the bully signal here and here as well, same as like that, once we will receive the bully signal, and at the same time, you can see stochastic is also very, very extreme uh, oversold. Therefore, after receiving that bullish signal, I'm expecting that it can start a massive price reversal from here, like uh, we did here as well and here as well. And then the price line can make another attempt to break out the resistance of the falling wedge pattern and the EMA 21 as well. Now, if we take a look at the final target for this breakout from this falling wedge pattern, then once it will be able to break it out, then the target to the upside can be here that will be approximately at. Uh, between $2 and 50 cents to $3. So this was the update so far. I hope that you've liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member, because here I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me here in the video description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.